The small business I am working with this semester is Millstone Cafe. Millstone brings people together with food, which works around a French-style feasting, including croissants, other pastries, cakes, breakfast, lunch, and so much more. The target audience found at Millstone can be high-income individuals, families with birthdays to celebrate, people with friends to go out to brunch with, females and males of all ages, but especially French people wanting to feel closer to home. The main competitor that Millstone faces is Claremont Cafe because they are directly opposite them. Not only can you find a great breakfast and lunch menu at Millstone, but there is also a great selection of cakes such as layer cakes, sponge cakes, pastries, canapes, small cakes, and of course, a catering menu. The first project I needed to do for Millstone was design a new logo. The logo was outdated of seven years. So the new logo prerequisites was something feminine, modern, simple, and classy. The logo process was with my friend who I thought was perfect for the job. As logo designers can become quite pricey, I thought there was no better way for experience in, towards my friend and to save money for Quinton. This is the new logo that was chosen by Quinton himself throughout the few weeks. The second project was a Millstone newsletter. The newsletter was going to be for important dates such as Christmas. This was going to include a Christmas menu, the opening and closure dates of Millstone, some photos and functions for people to book for Christmas parties. On your left is the new newsletter layout I have designed for the newsletter, of course seen with a new logo. The layout will be ready for the, when the Christmas menu has been finalised in both kitchen and pastry section. In the emails on your right are some brainstorming and emails stating the required information for the newsletter will be out soon but closer to Christmas. In the meanwhile, I am ready to write and post it once I get the menu. The third project was a cake order system. I decided to create an Excel with a data summary and secondly, work out the best way to keep track of orders in the future. Breaking down Excel. The first step was Quinton sent me all the data from orders over the past seven years, then group them and analyze them. And thirdly, place the top 10 of each category and send it to Quinton. The most popular item was the high tea box. The suburb that had the most orders was Malvern and East Melbourne, which was no surprise seeing as Millstone is located in Malvern. The person who ordered the most was a lady called Caroline who ordered over 26 times at Millstone, giving us great business. Quinton wishes to keep track of this information every month in a simple manner, which is the next thing that I begin. In order to cover Quinton's needs, I decided that the CRM was going to be the best. I did much research and many phone calls with different companies and created a word of the top 10 CRM companies needed for our business. Millstone is currently with Squarespace, but are going to slowly transition to Shopify, which suited me well when I found out Squarespace could not carry a CRM. So after getting into contact with Shopify and having research, knowing they could provide this, I knew it was the next step to take. Here are some screenshots of different emails and calls I had with some CRM companies, allowing me to tick off those that could work and those that would not. The last project was a new website. Quinton is after a new website for the catering side of the business. This will keep things separate from the cafe side and cake side. We purposely pushed this one back as Quinton wanted me to focus on the other ones first and ensure that the others were completed. The next steps to take is creating a Shopify account to add in the CRM of Quinton's choice, which is Keep. I will therefore integrate Keep to start building the new website for the catering and continue to keep track of the orders on this new CRM. I will finalise the newsletter for the 1st of December as this gives plenty of time for those wanting to make Christmas orders. As great as this project was, I will conti be continuing to work with them on a marketing level and this was only the beginning. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed.